My name is Supremo Pete. Research isn't going too well. Oh, this is Minecraft Weekly. And welcome to this week's texture pack spotlight. This week's texture pack is Frozen's texture pack. So let's have a look. We've got no custom paintings, but you can see here the stone and the wood is both custom. Custom ores, kind of like a splodge in the middle of a block. Glass is how I like it, so I always like glass like that. I guess it's a work in progress because quite a lot of blocks are not done. So no, no default UI there, but the kind of bottom bar it looks a bit different there. So. Let's see if we can find anything else that has changed in this pack. Let's go into the crafting room. And nothing here. Anything else? Let's go outside. So grass is definitely done. And the wall. And this stone. Remember this is a 16x texture pack actually. So that's why it's... Well, 16x-ish. All this is... It doesn't look like any mobs have been done. A lot of blocks have not been done. But the, the basic blocks have. Like wall. Grass. Stone. Glass. And the ores. You can see the red wall here. And you can see the wood. So yeah, this is the... Frozen's texture pack. Links in the description below where you can download it. And also, well, stay tuned for more updates on the pack because obviously it still has a lot more work to be done before it's complete. So, yeah, that's Frozen's texture pack. And coming up next, we got the skin spotlight. So, go ahead and watch that and come back next week for a new texture pack. See you in the next segment. And welcome back to this week's skin spotlight is this man. It's called the Man on Fire. And wow, it's kind of cool. And I thought I'd do something completely random related to no games or TV or anything. So the Man on Fire is this week's skin spotlight. And as you can see, it's pretty damn cool. So if you want to be a Man on Fire, the link's in the description below where you can download this. So... That's pretty much it for the skin spotlight this week. There'll be a skin spotlight next week, so stay tuned for that next week. And stay tuned now, because coming up next, we have the creation spotlight. And welcome to this week's creation spotlight. This week's creation is another awesome, awesome redstone construction by FE Disco, and it's called Zombie Siege. So I'm going to show you exactly what it does. In this chest, I've got my own bow and arrow gonna start now and waves of zombies should come out the other end so 50 50 there he hasn't changed yet so these buttons will oh god there we go there's some music one I'm guessing wave one is coming so let's launch the cannon is it gonna fire Boom! What's going on? Are they all dead? I don't understand it. They're not... They're just standing there. They can't be bothered. There we go! Long range cannon. No, long range cannon didn't work. Try mid range. Here we go. Oh. Still nothing. So they're sort of like... Oh, I need some long range. There we go. Cannon launched. Oh, we got some kills. Oh, and some more. I guess this works better at night. Oh. oh, yeah, we got some more kills over there. Come on. There we go. We got another kill. Oh, some more coming out of that one. Here we go. Nope. 
They don't want to seem to be bothered anymore. Stupid zombies. I can't hit them. Stupid zombies. So basically the zombies are supposed to get to the end anyway and when they get here they're supposed to go for the testificates in the holes and obviously go down there and you lose points or whatever. But you kind of get the idea. So this is Zombie Siege by FB Disco. It's pretty awesome. And you get to shoot TNT at zombies. So yeah, that's it for the creation spotlight this week. Join me again next week for a new creation. And until then, stay tuned. Minecraft news coming up next. Now it's time for this week's Minecraft news. Yeah, so. What is new this week? Well, there's no snapshot. And there's pretty much no news. Basically, Mojang have a Swedish holiday and there's... And Friday's a squeeze day or something, according to their website. So I have... No idea what that is, but... Basically, there's nothing new this week, apart from Minecraft on Xbox is doing very, very well. It's sold a lot of copies and it's like... I think it's the most played game on Xbox at the moment. I'm not sure. But it's beating out a lot of big games like Skyrim in terms of player numbers at the moment. So, yeah, that's it for this week's Minecraft news. And I'll be back next week where they hopefully will have a snapshot. So, yeah, that's it for the Minecraft news this week. Join me again next week for some more news and other, well, news. So yeah, stay tuned, see Spotlight coming up next, and yeah, see you there. And welcome, this week's Seed Spotlight is, wow, it's minus 12025052766239138143814. And this was sent in in the comments section of the last Minecraft Weekly by DDog3659. So let's create this world. Apparently it's supposed to spawn in a jungle and there's very cool mountain generation nearby. So I'll be the judge of that. When it generates the level, of course. Here we go. Well, we did spawn in the jungle. Alright. So there's supposed to be... Well, there's a tiger biome next to it. Nice river separating the biomes there. Well, I never understand how snow can be one block from a jungle. I don't know. So where is this cool mountain generation? Oh, I guess we found it. When my world decides to generate. So this is the cool mountain generation that D-Dog was on about. And this is pretty awesome. As, as you can see, it generating slowly here. This is pretty awesome mountain range next to the jungle here. We've even got some gravel falling down. Plenty of coal to get you started. That's pretty cool. I like this. So I actually very much approve of this mountain generation. So the seed is should be on the screen. I'm not reading it out again because it's too long. <laughs> but yeah, that's it for this week's Minecraft Weekly. So... No snapshot this week, but some cool stuff like a new texture pack, skin, and creation. And of course, this awesome seed. So, yeah. Join me again next week for a new Minecraft Weekly. And we're done for this week, so thanks for watching. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you next week. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.